to get this work done in this weekend and hand the trains back Tuesday morning for the public, the only way is to work around the clock. So I'm Matt Singleton, I'm the Senior Project Engineer on the Wellington Station project. This weekend we have stopped the trains running, turned off the power and we'll be installing two turnouts. A turnout is a piece of track that allows trains to move in different directions. They are part of the upgrade that allows for more trains to move within the station precinct. For the commuters this means a smoother, better commute into the station with less of the stop starts that we have currently. So today we kicked off at 4am, we had crews in at 2am getting ready, getting prepped, waiting for the wires to be turned off and uh, to be given the network back from the commuter trains being stabled. First crews in were slewing wires, so moving the overhead line out the way to allow us to crane track sections in. We also had crews come in and start cutting rails ready to remove in the daytime. Following them in, we have a crew coming in at 6 o'clock, we've got track gangs coming in from Wanganui, Palmy and the region locally in Wellington and they've been here removing track, making safe, and are now currently digging out ready for formation build, formations that are underpinning of the tracks. We did a bit of work in Christmas last year, big work at Easter, and then we'll start laying concrete sleepers. From here onwards, so about 10 o'clock, we've got the crane coming in. The crane will be lifting in four pre-built turnout sections. The, the turnouts arrive into the country as a, a kit of parts, like a Lego kit. The guys pre-assemble them in halves. We then either use loaders or cranes to put them in place on the network, before finally seating them in place with a surveyor and welding them down. So by the end of this weekend, we should have those panels ballasted, welded, and aligned correctly, ready for the tamper to come in. Mm -hmm. 